it's uh, everyone has Mol to. Molk and Sean S were livid about that time. I don't think Molk was mad. I think Sean S was livid. Like I think Molk was like, "Wow," and Sean S was like, "Ah." It was definitely a moment where it's like people who played Game and Watch was just winning. Like I kept on saying, Game and Watch versus Bayo is even, and no one can prove Tony. me otherwise. Tony, what's up? Tony in the chat, bless. Tony, who are you playing in Ultimate? He's definitely playing Snake. I, I should have known that, yeah. He's definitely playing Snake. All right. So Snake is definitely going to be one of the top five most seen characters in New York. I don't know about Long Island, but I know like a solid half of the city is playing Snake. And I know a good chunk of our Long Island guys are going to play Snake. I'm not touching Snake. I'm just going to play Ike. I mean, that was also going to be like 8,000 Ikes. Yeah, I think that's going to die off pretty quickly. And plus, like, Long Island is not a very meta-heavy scene. No, we don't care. Like, the two players we've got in front of us right now are probably the most meta of Are you characters. telling me the buzz is not meta? Oh, yeah, the buzz is meta, but he's not in front of us right now, is he? That's fair. Although he's definitely, like, committing to Olimar. Has he said that? Yeah, he's committing to Olimar in, uh, in Ultimate because he looks, like, super ridiculous. He does look absurd. I was seeing online people who are like just getting into Smash with Ultimate, which, by the way, that's a crazy enough uh, idea. Uh, call Olimar's Ultimate Smash a launcher. Yeah, because it, you follow the Pikmin. It's kind of insane. That's so ridiculous. But like, we do have a few players who like play a character because they're good, and there's no fault to that. It's just that we also have yeah, a lot of weird players or weird character choices. I should say. Yeah, like you can't fault someone for playing a top tier. Because, like, the, if you want to win, play the best character. Yeah. Like, there's no reason to fault them for it. It's like, by that logic, you would expect us to have a lot of Bayonettas. And we used Kinda, to. <laughs> we did for a long time. But, like, they weren't dominating anything. They would take their wins on Mr. E, and then they'd just collect L's for all eternity. That's fair enough. Every once a month, you'd lose to a Bayo. Like, yeah, bound to happen. Then you move on with a day. Yeah. Or at least that's what I would do. <laughs> You know what I realized today while I was walking around the, the venue while Bubbles was happening? Uh, I think Vinny and Ippo are the only two people who play Cloud and Bubbles. Everyone else yeah. has opted to grow an Ike for Doubles. I don't know why. Well, I do know why. You know why because you play Ike. <laughs> but I want to know why why Dirds, DT60, and I saw one other person who's like a new face playing Ike. Oh, he's mad fun. Yeah, but like... He's good in doubles. There's no other way about it. So is Cloud. So Cloud is better. Like, there's no other way about that either. <laughs> it's, uh, I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Mystery took the first stock, and I'm not really sure what move did it. I don't know who won dubs. Um, Mystery and Vinny. No, they didn't. No, no, no. It was, it was Mystery and Raptor. Yeah, okay. Yeah, because yeah, Vinny and Stock Taker reset the bracket, and then. No, Vinny and Stock Taker were in Windows. Yes. No, they were. Oh, okay, I have no idea. They're in losers. They reset the bracket, and then uh, Ian Raptor took it back over them. I got my fourth. I really thought you and Kyoko were gonna be able to take it over uh, Crazy Colors with the buzz. I shouldn't have given them battlefield. <laughs> I should, that was my bad. Big oopsie. <laughs> yeah. Meanwhile, I think I've had a team with someone. I've seen it before. I would have probably at least had a better shot. But anyway, this is some chic Lucina. I'm so desensitized to this matchup. Yeah, you know, it's it's really crazy. Because, like, you ever tra you've traveled to an event where Eric's at before, right? You traveled to Frostbite. He, he was there, yeah. Uh, you ever, if you ever travel with Mystery outside of New York, it you get reminded that people, like, know he's, him. He's revered. So, like, people, people see him as one of the hype players, which is, like, they're not wrong. Yeah, he's he's... Willing to press the Ooga Bunga buttons when no other top player can. And meanwhile, we see him press the Ooga, but Ooga buttons, and it's like, yep, that's that's Mr. That's e. it. Ooh, that's not it. That's really good, DI. I always get surprised when that doesn't kill. Ooh, that's what not it. All right. Vinny working for that bread today. I want to see an upbeat kill. Yeah, this this match is about to get you know, robbed. You no, know it's Vinny. an upbeat kill from Eric. Like Vinny missed two, almost assured kills. That was a that was a risky get up there. Yo! Ah, oh, that was 
pretty hype. I'm surprised Fair killed fast. I knew game one gets robbed from Vinny. No, Eric earned that. You win. You live like that three times in a row. That's a, that's good stuff. And it had to be the DBZ end too. All right, I'm about it. Because now it means that Vinny's going to turn it up. I mean, you say he was robbed, but Eric did have the lead. <laughs> for, for, he for did, but it's like, I don't know, man. When you ever you see Sheik fail one of those uh, yeah. kill confirms, like, he lands it. He just doesn't get the kill. You just feel bad almost. Almost. It takes a lot for me to feel bad for Sheik. <laughs> <laughs> She's the definition of if you're playing well, you shouldn't lose. That's another thing is we don't get a chance to see Sheiks often. You see Void and you see Mr. R, and and then I've, it's like Vinny Carna and someone else. I'm sure I'm forgetting, and that really falls off hard. Yeah, and even at that, you you could argue that there's the uh, the deficit between Karna and Vinny, but I think it's just the fact that they don't really travel too far out of their respective regions. Yeah, Karna beat someone, I think. I I yeah, just recently. Um, in Texas, I want to say. He did really I well. Would, I would think so. Got to double check that. All I know is that you can't sleep on the Sheik players that stuck with this character. That's it. I think Vinny even gave the solemn nod as Sheik just goes careening into the blast zone. He's just like, yeah. That's a good grab, yeah. It's so weird when you play someone all the time because, like, the sets are rehearsed. Like, you know what combos are coming if you mess up. Yeah. I think that's one of my favorite parts whenever I, uh, whenever I'm at Aeon, really. And especially when I commentate because it's, like, I'm so used to seeing these guys go for the same sets of mix-ups. Like, yeah. They have, like, what they want to go for, and then they have options outside <laughs> Out of what they, what need they to. Go. Yeah. I'll be there it is. It's like, I don't even know if desensitized would be the right word for it, but it's just like you know what they want. In my head, it is. And you I know how they're going to. It's just like you know how they're going to go for it. It's yeah. like if you see the future, you're not going to be excited about seeing the future. Oh. That's probably one of my favorite things to see is people power shield, shield breaker. If I uh, remember yeah. correctly, that, that wasn't a thing in the earlier Smash There's game. no way. This is such a weird thing. Because that was game if he held it just a bit longer. I think he's doing a really good job now keeping Eric in the air. That's what he's got to do while he's got FD. It's all about the juggles, all about the frame trap, all about get him to the ledge whenever he can. Because that's really the only way that he's going to make sure that he has room to move. But Eric never has an issue with landing. It's really weird. Like, Lucina doesn't have the greatest of landing options. It's just that Eric has such a good understanding of what to do against a yeah. player and a character. Landing options are pretty valuable in this game, too. Wow, Bouncing Fish such a solid move. Smashing Fish. Oh, what a Hello? That's enough to. Oh, that was weird. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she has a new win theme in Ultimate. It would be cool if everyone got unique ones. They, um, they give a few weird choices for characters who got them. Like, the uh, Fire Emblem 13 characters got a, uh, a mix of it purpose. Okay. Uh, K. Rule has, I, I don't know what he has, but I know he usually doesn't the count. villains get something different. Yeah, I think they gave K. Rule something along the lines of King Clank Galleon. Uh -huh. Um, like Bowser's got like an electric guitar or something. Yeah, because that's a villainy. Him, him, and Junior, I think, have their same with theme. I uh, got to double check who else got new. That stuff. was yeah. That was really good. That guy was jump. He's done. Ooh, that got him out of his jump. But, oh, no, it didn't. 
Nice. The assault continues though. He's not too happy about the fact that he lost. Uh, He's trying to two frame with that snake. Good call out of Bantam Fish. Up the ledge, back to the down throw. It's not going to get much, but read out the options. Please, <laughs> not like this. He <laughs> smashed four. Ooh, Looked like yeah. the stuff of Rar Bear and his string, and that's what he escaped. A bit unfortunate, but like. He'll be able to repeat the process again. This is actually a phenomenal game for Vinny. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And yeah, that early bouncing fish to bait the air dodge. There's not much you can do after that. You know, it's funny how you can get nail biters like games one and two, and then it's just a slaughterhouse for game three. Yeah, Belmont's a really true to their character. Do you see Belmont's can angle their fair? Yes. Oh, I'm not about that. Oh, it's so gross. Ugh. And that's how they grab ledge. It's really weird. I mean, there's no reason to give him the Zare if it's going to be the same thing as their fair. No, he doesn't have a Zare. Nope. It's just forward air and back air. And, uh, Can back air grab the ledge? Yes. Forward air and back air grab the ledge. They just have a regular, like, person grab. <laughs> person. They grab with their hands. Human beings. Belmont's another character that a lot of people have expressed interest in that I'm excited for. Like, I got what I wanted. I got music from Castlevania. Uh, like, I'm going to try out the Belmonts just out of obligation because they, they look like a really weird type of character. They're heavy zoners. Yeah, I'm not about the zoner guys, so I'm going to skip them. It's understandable. I respect them. You know one character I expected to get a little bit more traction? Ridley? Yes, Ridley and Inkling, I'm surprised not a lot of people are showing too much hype for it here on Long Island. Inkling, no, I've talked to a few people that are definitely going to play Inkling. Um, Kofi, Kofi actually asked today, he said he's going to play Inkling. Or at least try him. Like, I know I want to try Inkling, but like, I like Splatoon. There's not a lot of people here that I know have vocal interest in Splatoon. Um, I have no interest in Splatoon. It's really because, like, if anyone would like to buy me Splatoon, they can. And well, now we've got a game five. Yo, that game definitely happened, that was but quick. I, I feel like, I feel like game four didn't really happen. Yeah, that was quick. Like there was no in interaction with Sheik. Edge that guards. Was just... Some Sheik edge guards. Like Sheik things definitely happened, but. Ralphie, I thought you were playing Pokemon Trainer. Ralphie, I started playing Dragalia Lost. Send help. Oh, no. Why would you do that to yourself? It looked fun, and Fire Emblem Heroes stopped being fun. Oh, FD's not the pick. No, this is true game five. One stock each. <laughs> One stock. Wait for the timer to go to three minutes. Fortnite. No, I've never played Fortnite in my life. I tried it once. It was not, it's not my kind of game. I will get hooked in it, and I know it, so I'm not going to do that. Civ 6, I will gladly get hooked in. Oh, yeah, that's right. For those of you who are tuned in, um, we have a crew battle later on tonight. Oh, God, am I in that? I want to uh, be in that. That'll be fun to watch. Long Island loves crew battles, dude. That's actually one thing I'm really like in love with our scene about is that like everyone's always down for crew battles. Yeah, like, and everyone's down for teams. Yes. Other places, they don't got teams like we do. And that makes me very happy. This team's is better than single. That's, that's, that's as good. We are, we're actually going to have one of the best regions in the world for doubles in Ultimate. Because the melee guys love doubles. And Long Island melee is historically really strong. Yeah. And Long Island uh, Smash 4 doubles really strong. is really strong. My biggest regret is not doing better at doubles at a major. Solid, I think if you stick for it in ultimate, I think you'll make a name for yourself. <laughs> I actually have to go to majors to do well at them. Yes. <laughs> that's, that's the first that's, and foremost. You got to go out to travel and play the video Let's game. Let's make moves was capped. I was so sad. I didn't think doubles was going to get capped, but it did. Do you not have a teammate? or? No, the registration was capped. I'm on a wait list. Oh. Very sad. I don't know if I'm going to go. I might cancel. 
See, this is why I registered for doubles. You know, I didn't think it would run out that quick. Uh, that's silly, silly me. I know, I know it's my fault, but like I'm kind of tight. No, no. If Vinny got the right hitbox with that tilt, that was about to be disgusting. What? Yo, when Lucina starts doing that short hop side B stuff, I have no idea what's going on. Oh yeah, that's where Eric's movement gets fancy, and it's like he goes from Neanderthal who invented the hammer to Neanderthal who uses the torch. <laughs> you get scared. <laughs> like oh. he found fire and he knows how to use it. Wow, that protect him off stage. That was like, oh no. Not like this. No, oh, Vinny's gonna end it in a cool combo. Or Eric is gonna unga buttons. Yeah, that's how. That's what they gotta do. We need an ending like we had game one. It was close. Game two was close too. Game one, both characters flying to the opposite sides of the screen. That's what I'm trying to see. Give me some bookends to this set. This has actually been a really good set. Yeah, Eric's brought this back game five. More specifically, the last stock of game five. Vinny like, had games one and two were pretty close. Eric took them. Vinny decided it was time to win. And now we're at a mostly even game. Is that going to kill? Nah, not with that DI. That looked like good DI to me. It was like average. It's like if you're playing a rhythm game, you don't get the perfect, but it's still like excellent or some shit. Up, do we go? Yeah. Wow, Eric really turned it up the last star. He wanted it, man. And now he's sitting in Winterside Grants for it. 